In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you how you can easily create an inline form in your system.io account. So inline form are forms that are usually placed within the content of your website. So you have content, 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 and there's form. So basically, it's just to put a form inside your website. And sometimes you want to have a form that is standardized, right? Instead of like every time create a new form. And this can be done using inline form in system.io. Now, before I continue, if you're new to this channel, do subscribe to this channel so that you can get more digital marketing tips for your business. Now, without further ado, let's jump into my computer and let me show you how you can create an inline form using system.io. Let's go. Let me show you how you can quickly create an inline form with your system.io platform. So the inline form will be very good if you want to put it into an external page or even to the system.io page itself, a blog or anywhere in the website. So let me just go to funnels, sales funnels. So just create, just put whatever name you want to do, uh, currency on US dollar. Okay, so just click on build on the audience, save. It could be anything, it does not matter. All right, just, just click on sample, click on it. You can get started with this platform for totally free. So just click on the link in the description box below or the comment below just to get started. So this is really amazing and do many, many things with it. Next, you go to add steps, just create. Anyone can do inline form sample right so there's a few steps as you can see a squeeze page thank you page inline form pop-up form i'll talk about pop-up form next time let's start with inline form first let's just click on inline form click on save you can select a few so you can just preview a template and you can see how it looks like so basically this form will be embedded inside your website uh, like i said whether in system.io website or you want to put it into your wordpress website or any website or have another video on how to link these forms inside wordpress website but currently let's just show how you can create it first okay you can subscribe here i think this one is a general one that we like to usually use so as you can see there's wordings then there's a place where you can subscribe click on select you can view final step and you'll show you how it looks like so basically this is just an example right there's some words and then this is the place where you have the form or you can just click on edit page and then you can edit accordingly you can edit the size settings you can check the size all this you can play around with this it's like any other landing page design or creation is basically margin and paddings so you can just play around with this so for this case you're using padding more often yeah shadows as well Okay, there's a lot of things you can play around with. Next, if you want to have more import fields, scroll down, you can see form input. Just put it here. For example, you want name, first name. Okay, you can arrange accordingly. Okay, and then there's a button here which you can edit. What happens when they submit the form? So the next step, you can add automation rule. For example, when they sign up, you can put them into the email marketing list. And then you can add more information, you can put pictures, you can even change the colors here. Let's change the color. So for example, you want this color. Okay, button. I want to change the different colors. So you can see there's a lot of options here. Colors. All right. So this looks good. And then you can just click save changes. And there you have your inline form ready to be embedded anywhere else. So where are you going to embed this? Let's just exit this page. Click on script. And this is where you embed the page. It applies to any external website as well. You can put it into WordPress, which I'm going to show in another video. Or you can put it in any other builder as well. You can even put it in ClickFunnels or any other pages. All you have to do is just create that HTML, HTML element and then put it in and then you'll be there. Just to make sure to test it. So all right, uh, that's how you create easily create inline form. Of course, you can put it with your funnel. If not, you can just create a special funnel just to have all these forms ready and then you can link it accordingly. If you want to try this platform again, it's totally free. I've been using it for some of my clients for free as well. I created a website for them, created a funnel for them. This is really amazing. Then when they are ready, just upgrade it. It's very cheap as well compared to other software out there which they charge per year what people charge per month. Of course, there's, each platform has different pros and cons. But it's for you to try and to see which one that you like. I would suggest for you to try this first if you're starting out. If you like what I share, do subscribe to this channel and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.